possible for the for the playoffs. But um, you know what the what the Suns have done in the last few years has been incredible. You know they have an incredible roster, great balance, two way players um, have formed uh, incredible chemistry and, and cohesion. I think Monty's been terrific. So. They have the roster, they have the IQ and cohesion, and then they have a coach who's just done a tremendous job. So they're, uh, I think, very worthy uh, contenders, uh, favorites possibly, and also, um, you know, a team that that, that clearly is, you know, going to break some records this year. Coach, I know the, the goal is just to get better each and every day, um, but with this season winding down, how much of an emphasis has been put on the way you play at home ahead of the, ahead of the postseason? It's a tough one, you know, like... It, you know, what comes first, uh, playing well and improving or, hey, we got to fix this home situation. You would hope by playing well and improving, we fix the home situation. So, you know, I don't I don't necessarily lead with that at all. Um, I don't want it to become a thing necessarily. I think um, we just want to play good basketball, home or away, and uh, improve and find, like I said, that cohesion, that identity, both sides and refine what we're trying to do. And like, you know, we're, we're on the clock. We know that. So, how far along can we get before uh, the playoffs start? And then and then how prepared are we to, to win a playing game? Yeah, I mean, we uh, clearly we'd love to have Ben playing for us. Um, you know, and uh, we uh, we hope we get him back. But we're at the same time every day, we, we can't prepare um, because we don't know when or if and, and how that is going to happen. So, you know, we just, like I said earlier, play what's in front of us. That's the group that's available today and how we can best compete against the Bucks. Thank you. All right. Thanks, guys.